Hi, hello students. Um, we are discussing alternating current exercise numericals. Uh, we have seen up to problem number 7.5 in our previous video. So now we will continue from problem number 7.6. So here I have uh, written the problem. It's again a very simple problem. They are asking resonance frequency and it's an LCR circuit. A value of inductance is given. L is equal to uh, 2 Henry and uh, capacitance is also given which is 32 microfarad and immediately we will write 32 into 10 power minus 6 uh, farad uh, we just have to substitute we know the formula omega naught or omega r is equal to 1 by root lc so 1 by root over 2 into 32 into 10 power minus 6 so 10 power minus 6 comes out of the root 10 power minus 3 goes to numerator becomes 1000. 1000 by uh, root 64 it's a uh, easy number. So 1000 by 8 and the answer is uh, 125 and it is uh, resonance frequency radian per second. So 125 radian per second is the answer. We found uh, resonant frequency. And also here they have asked one more thing. They asked us to calculate Q factor also, quality factor. We know the general formula voltage across across L R C by applied voltage. That is the general formula for Q factor. And uh, either either it can be an inductive network or it can be a capacitive network. So we can write uh, XL by R or XC by R or if you put the value of XL, L, Omega naught then after substitution we have one more formula Q factor is equal to 1 by R into root over L by C. We are going to use this formula because R value is given, L value is given and C value is also given. All the three values are there. Just a substitution will give you the answer. See, I have substituted the values R is 10 ohm and uh, L value and C value. So, it's a simple you can you can see. So, 2 will get cancelled 16 and 10 power minus 6. So, taking to the numerator becomes 10 power 6. Taking out uh, the root, it will become 10 power 3. 10 power 3 already 10 is there and 1 by root 16. So, 4. So it will be 1000 by uh, 40. So it will be 25. So Q factor. So Q factor or quality factor is 25. And it does not carry any unit. It's a factor. So only 25 is the answer for Q factor. And now moving to problem number 7.7. .7. So capacitance value is given 30 microfarad which means 30 into 10 power minus 6 and again inductance is given 27 milli henry so 27 into 10 power minus 3 henry and uh, capacitance is farad again again the same problem they are asking the resonance frequency so omega naught or omega r you are supposed to find again the same formula 1 by root lc again substitution will give you the answer very straightforward and a simple problem so you would have studied lc oscillations so, so here l and c both are there again just substitution so 27 milli henry so minus 3 into 30 micro so 10 power minus 6 so what we can do is 1 by root uh, always in root now if the powers are in even number then it will be easy so what you can do 27 into 3 and the 10 power minus 3 is there. So 30 you are making into 3. So I can make it 10 power minus 8. Then taking it up. Uh, uh, removing from the root. So 10 power 4. 10 power 4 by uh, 81. Again a uh, straight forward number. So 10 power 4 by direct root is there. So 9 nines are 81. So 10,000 by 9, so it will be 1, 1, 1, 1 and it is again radian per second. 
we can also write 1.11 into 10 power 3 so whichever way you write uh, you will be getting marks so this is the frequency that is the angular frequency of the free oscillations the lc oscillation will oscillate with this uh, angular frequency of this answer <clears throat> So now coming to problem number 7.8. So here is the continuation of the previous problem. Uh, they have given the Q value that is uh, 6 milli coulomb charge value they have given. That is 6 into 10 power minus 3 coulomb. And they are asking the total energy stored in the circuit. So, so initially energy is provided from capacitor. You know energy stored in capacitor you know 3 formulas half CV square. Q square by 2C and half QV here I will go for 1 by 2 Q square by C because Q value is given so 6 into 10 power minus 3 the whole square 2 is there and capacitance value already we know which we can take from the previous uh, numerical so I think it's 30 micro farad right so 30 micro 10 power minus 6 so if you solve this you will be getting the answer so 36 into 10 power minus 6 I am scoring 2 into 30 10 power minus 6 so 10 power minus 6 will get cancelled so if I can cancel out our possible so I am getting 6 by 10 so which is 0.6 so energy so, so the unit is joule so 0.6 joule is the energy stored initially so they are asking energy at later time so energy at later time means you know very well so what happens initially capacitor is charged and that will get discharged and that will go, go to inductor so inductor will be charged so that's what it happens in lc oscillations you know very well so it very well uh, abides with law of conservation of energy so energy remains same so energy remains uh, same constant so you can write law of conservation of energy <clears throat> so in our cbse textbook uh, this topic is explained nicely in page number uh, 256 and this lc oscillation is analogous to uh, spring also that is nicely explained so total energy remains uh, same at all instants so so you can uh, go to this page number and you can you can check also yeah now moving to problem number 7.9 so again a series lcr circuit problem r value is given l value is given c is given connected to a variable frequency and 200 volt ac supply so here is that important uh, the condition is given here when the frequency of the supply equals to the natural frequency so matching with the natural frequency yes i think you got the word resonance so again it's a resonance circuit and they are asking what is the average power so they are asking power average and uh, it is given resonance circuit so resonance circuit means you know very well z is equal to r xl value will be equal to xc so you need not uh, take z you can take z as r and you know power average is equal to vrms irms or v squared rms by z instead of z we can put r so i'm going to use this formula because the voltage input is given here 200 volt so so 200 square by and r value is also given 20 so again it's a, again a straightforward problem so you may see why this why this l value and c value is given just to confuse you so when they mention uh, that uh, na frequency matches with the natural frequency immediately you conclude it's a resonance circuit so resonance means z is equal to r so you can simply do this problem so if you simplify you will get 2000 watt or 2 kilowatt so that is the average power consumed in one complete cycle suppose in this problem if they ask uh, i rms means again v rms by i is equal to v by r so again r because the resonance you not go for z 
suppose if at all if at all so 200 by 20 so 10 amperes so if at all if at all they asked you to calculate irms it is 10 ampere and see you can cross check a vrms irms again you can go for that route also power average is vrms irms to 200 into 10 so 2000 so whichever way you'll get the same answer yes now moving on to the 10th 10th problem so radio it's about a tuning circuit so it has a medium wave broadcast band from 800 kilohertz to 1200 kilohertz uh, the inductance value is given so l is equal to 200 micro henry so 200 into 10 power minus 6 henry a frequency range is given so lower end is 800 kilohertz which means 800 into 10 power 3 or 8 into 10 power 5 hertz and the upper range is also given 1200 kilohertz so 12 into 10 power 5 hertz so so two frequencies both the frequencies are given so the lower end and the upper end so we know omega naught is equal to 1 by root lc or 2 pi f naught is equal to 1 by root lc so f naught is equal to 1 by 2 pi root lc so here we want to find the capacitance so we want to find uh, so they are given two frequency ranges so we want to find uh, two capacitance values so we will square the equation because the c what we are supposed to find is inside the root so we can we can square this equation so f square is i'm not writing f not f square 1 by 2 pi 4 pi squared lc i want to find c so 1 by 4 pi squared l f square so this is my required formula so first time using the input 8 uh, into 10 power 5 that frequency so let me find the respective capacitance value so everything is there in the denominator so you have to deal carefully so power power you can sort out the power um so 8 uh, 8 square so 64 and then so 10 power 10 will be there so 10 power 10 then 10 power minus 6 so 10 power uh, uh, plus 4 then here again two zeros are there even you can take so 10 power 6 so if i solve this i'll get 1.98 into 10 power minus 10 farad or i can change it into 198 into 10 power minus 12 farad so i can write 198 pico farad so this is one value of capacitance for 800 kilohertz frequency yeah now the same same way i have to do for the 1200 kilohertz also again just a substitution so 1 by 4 pi squared again i will take 2 so 12 12 are 144 again 10 power 10 so 10 power plus 6 so if i solve it will come to 8.80 into 10 power minus 11 farad so i can make it 88 into 10 power minus 12 farad so again i can write it in pico so pico farad this is this is the another capacitance so the previous was 198 and this is 88 so the range of the capacitance so range of capacitance that is from 88 picofarad to 198 picofarad so this is the capacitance range which i require so the range of the capacitor which i require uh, for the tuning circuit will be this 88 to 198 so basically in all the tuning circuits so so we basically move the knob when we move the knob we are actually changing the capacitance values so it's basically a variable capacitor which we are adjusting so when that particular frequency is matching with the channel frequency we get the 
channel that's how it works so yes so we have worked out uh, the 10 numericals of this alternating current uh, lesson already I, I put a separate video uh, for the problem number 7.11 which you can see I'll try to share the link in this video itself see all the numericals so we are as of now we are not discussing going to discuss additional exercise maybe later time I will try to put a video so AC lesson numerical all numericals are covered so all the very best study well thank you share this video to your friends and like the page and if you have not subscribed please subscribe to our channel thank you